joining Michael, one of the inmates from my unit who has been given a job on the psychiatric floor. One, one and four. This is one of the only jails in America with a facility dedicated to mental health. This is what you got to wear, this is your... A lot of times you guys will flood their floors, you know, um, we got to clean them all up and stuff like that a lot of times, and we we have to do that. And uh, so we put boots on, so you don't get all the, you know, the stuff on your feet, sheets, and, you know, and your urine, you know, and stuff like that. It's, sometimes it's nasty, it really is. So how often and how regular is it that it's going to be it's on a daily, it's daily basis sometimes. Two beds for mentally ill inmates, all in constant use. And in this unit, they're confined for 23 hours a day. The first time you came down here, what was you thinking? Because this couldn't be more different to the pub that we stay in. Oh, it's totally different. Yeah. yeah. When, I, when I first came down here, I didn't know what to think about all this. And, uh, it, it took a little bit of getting used to it. No, throw it up under the door. Uh, all right, I'll get it. Up under the door. Okay. Then I'll lock it up under the door. Jail staff supervise the cells, and a separate medical team handle the inmates' mental health treatment. Apparently, the inmates are all incredibly unpredictable. So, during June, they get taken out of the cell, and we're sort of left to work, um, work the mess, as it were. So, let's see what happens. It sounds like this guy over here isn't the biggest fan of me chatting away on him. Yeah, yeah, he thinks I'm talking about him. And he's giving me, giving me a name, which, uh, I've got a feeling this is going to be, this is going to be a repeat of the entire time that I'm in there, so I'm going to try and get used to that. Oh, oh man. his behavior from shouting to a dirty protest. I've not been told what sort of a mess he's made, but I can smell it. What is that? Due to the sensitive nature of the cases here, 
Bear County have requested we don't speak with the inmates or medical team on this wing, but I can talk to the sheriffs. I mean, I've seen some off-the-wall stuff in that unit alone. My arm. The guy dug out his arm. 